Hello students, the question is a solid sphere in its rolling motion. In rolling motion, a body possesses translational kinetic energy as well as rotational kinetic energy simultaneously. The ratio of kT to kT plus kR is that is translational kinetic energy divided by total kinetic energy. Now we know in rolling motion kinetic energy or translational kinetic energy is half mv square where v is the velocity of the center of mass and kr is that is rotational kinetic energy is half i omega square. Now i can be written as mk square and for pure rolling omega can be written as v by r. So rotational kinetic energy finally becomes half mv square into k square by r square. Mind it k is the radius of gyration. Therefore total kinetic energy is kt plus kr taking half mv square common Therefore, kT divided by total kinetic energy will be will be r square divided by r square plus k square. Now I again mention k is the radius of gyration. Therefore for a solid sphere we know moment of inertia about the diametrical axis is 2 by 5 mr square. So I can write k as root over or k square as 2 by 5 r square now putting this value it will become 5 divided by 7 well that is the answer option 2 is correct thank you for watching this video